another one of these silly magazines and a little bit of chocolate. Or maybe not. <laughs> yeah, I bought it because of the biscotti. I quite like the biscotti. So, let's have a look. Here I was just admiring her everything, legs and booty. So even me, I get a bit silly from time to time. And here I remembered that our nice Lily Allen was during this burning in London of the that high towering building. She was standing She was standing in front of a green screen, so I thought maybe her wedding is green screen as well. A test whether we would get it or not. <laughs> so I gave him and her some lashes on this one. And that Pline guy, I just don't know anything about, but maybe it's something like Balenciaga, you know, I'm going to be very late in the game, but I'm gonna finally get it. <laughs> so, what kind of a mouth did I give her? <laughs> oh, that's the train over there. Hmm? Yeah. So, the hangers that I was spraying all summer long I gave her here on her mouth it's a silly you know I don't want to give them all the piercings I ever had or the lashes I like so much but since I had the Leonardo da Vinci book lately I figured oh yeah she's got the, one of those you know da Vinci noses the angle I'm gonna show you on another pic and then of course the corona hair she got. Hmm? <laughs> so here, she, this, this girl is so thin, but actually her bathing suit makes her look fat. So she should have some hangers here, some not just, you know, a bra going from here to there. And down here you can still tell her bathing suit was kind of like, you know, showing off everything. But if she had a bathing suit like this, she'd look better. There you go. She tries so hard to become a TV presenter. So when I... And people are bitching about her. She's called K Kathy Hummels. And when I saw her the first time, I went like... Minkia, who's that? What a, what a bad job this person is doing. I wasn't believing it, but then I read about it and then I went like, oh yeah. <laughs> I witnessed her stiff kind of, yeah. I'd be even more stiff presenting something. So I gave her, I tried to give that Lena Gerke, I think it is, yeah, some lashes that would open her eyes. But on her, it's really difficult. It never works. Her eyes are in a way so that it ain't possible. So here we have Brittany. I like her face a lot. It was easy to give her the eyebrow that goes up. You can still tell the way she does it and the way I would do it. And then also in the mid of the pupil, of course, I would add the lashes and not on the ends of the eyes. So here I went a little bit berserk on the title <laughs> yeah I, I buy these magazines when I'm bored right so here we got <laughs> no they're over there <laughs> yeah I gave her a lot of these you know And basically, I was admiring her beautiful face. You know, sometimes I'm really just not really... 
creating any new thoughts or imagery. So I have to tell you that these sort of skirts, they're all plastic, of course. But I had bought one this summer. I think it was by H&M, Hennes and Moritz. And then I saw one in a, a high-priced uh, clothing shop with all sorts of colors, you know, going up. And I want to have that one, even though I know also that one is going to be plastics. This is like really me being bored, you know. <laughs> you can tell. But here I went a little bit more like, you know, sophisticated on everything. But still, I'm, I was just scribbling and doing stuff with the pen. Here too, I was admiring the legs. And it's really difficult when you have skinny body features to actually draw a nice nude but if you've got fat people that one works very well so yeah i was kind of practicing how would that look like skinny legs there is no chance to put any shadows right <laughs> they're so skinny and all so here you could help me out a bit because i went chandra watson right Chandra, I didn't Google it. It might exist. I'm not sure. I've got no idea. Who this be? Uniform metal force. They dress so ugly, but they kind of make us fall for all the uniforms right in previous magazine reviews i told you that i don't like the style when people have like here it's fine the weight on top not like on on on, on skirt level or crotch level so you're not distracted looking at her face even the same here the most light stuff is on top because there you tend to look at to the towards the light areas so here you know all these uh, meals go without proteins they just ha are full of starches sugars they have no minerals no vitamins like you know potato rice or noodles you don't need these three you need proteins so what i bought is eggs and cheese and by that i can tell you my poo is mwah, exquisite so the very last thing i wanted to show you is these again hangers and if you want to order the corona or the hanger or the crack in the wall do so i got it and then even the fingers I could paint some fingers behind your couch. Just order and I'll be flying by. And if you got some clothes that you want to be uh, having pimped up by me, I can put the corona on your clothes, right? Or I could even go and give you the finger. Oh, sorry, this sounds so nasty. <laughs> on your interior design or the hanger, okay? So I think that's about it. Oh no, there is one more page. So he's talking about chewing gum and so my Corona looks like a chewing gum as well. Doesn't it? And then she talks about lashes. So I figured, oh yeah, I see lashes in there too, in a box, in a round one. And of course the cookie she talks about, or the snack, everyone can see the cookie in this one. And since she talks about the PlayStation, why not have a play disc? someday <laughs> and then of course Georgina I gave her some real nice hair and everything I like her a lot and since she talks about women divas 
I gave her, yeah, the woman seen from top, God view, looks a bit like this, doesn't it? <coughs> Where's the other one? <laughs> there is some really annoying people passing by, so I'm doing the second part in a second. <laughs>